the next type of the strategy is trading breakouts. Strategy centered on trading breakouts means that a trader will look to buy an asset as it makes new highs or to sell an asset as it makes new lows. New highs and lows can easily be spotted on a chart as they are the extremums of previous moves. And many professional traders use these techniques when they are managing large sums of money and looking for a major trend to develop. So the philosophy for this strategy is simple. A market cannot continue its trend without making new highs or new lows. And this strategy works best when trends are strong and long lasting. It uh, does not matter whether a trend is up or down as the trader is buying new highs and selling at new lows. And of course, one critical drawback of this strategy is that it performs poorly when markets are not able to establish strong trends and trade in ranges. And the next type of the strategy is swing trading. So it is focused on technical analysis. And swing trading involves finding short-term price patterns to trade. Swing traders tend to focus solely on price, paying less attention to value when finding an asset to trade. And uh, so if speaking now about the positions, positions can be held from one to several days, longer than day trades, but shorter than position trades. And swing traders will sometimes trade against the trend if their analysis shows an opportunity. Uh, of course, when you are going to combine a few strategies in a portfolio, you should look for the strategies of different types. So I think most of strategies that you have are swing trading strategies. Maybe some of them are range trading strategies. Stop.